What's poppin' YouTube? It's DBTown24 here, and I'm back with you guys with another discussion video. Most people have already heard this, but if you haven't, Jordan Brand is supposed to be raising their retail price from 180 to 190. And I'm honestly sitting here wondering why the hell are people so shocked? This is textbook business and marketing, guys. I'm gonna quote JSTAR on this one. If Jordan Brand will continue to sell out in five minutes on Nike.com, why wouldn't they be raising their prices? But nonetheless, people wanna know what's my thoughts on the whole price raise and uh, what price is too high for me. So let's start off with the first one. How do I feel on the price raise? I mean, I don't know, guys. People are asking me how do I feel, but in the end, me and a lot of, and millions of other people are still gonna be buying these shoes. The moment Jordan Brand will stop raising these prices is the moment we all realize that these are just shoes and that they really hold no type of value. Let me give you guys a quick example. If McDonald's decides to raise their famous McChickens to $5, no one is buying that because we as a people have it installed in our brains that McChickens are and will forever be valued at a dollar. I wouldn't pay two dollars for a McChicken, I wouldn't pay a dollar fifty, I wouldn't pay a dollar twenty-five. I'd pay about a dollar and seven cents. Why? Because to me, that's what a McChicken is worth. The problem with shoes is each shoe is worth different. So when people say, oh, if they raise this price to 190, I'm not paying for it, you're lying. I will say this, if Jordan Brand raised their, their prices to 200 bucks, that's cutting out a lot of general releases for me. But if the Columbia's came out, or I believe they're calling them the Legend Blues this year, if when those come out in December, if they're retailing for 200 bucks, I'm still buying them. Which is why this will never be like the McChicken. If McChicken prices raise, McChickens aren't selling. You know, no matter how much they raise these shoes, if they raise a shoe, uh, you know, X amount of dollars, but they lower the quantity of them, X amount, that shoe's gonna sell. I promise you guys, if those Yeezys retail for $1,000, they still would've sold out. So with that being said, what is retail? Like, I, I don't get what people get so mad about retail, knowing good and damn well they wouldn't mind paying that price if this shoe was limited. Now, of course, I can't speak for everyone when I say this, but there are still millions of people out there that buy shoes based on how limited they are, and those people <laughs> will still make these shoes sell out. So in the end, if Jordan Brand raises their prices and a group of people are like, okay, we're gonna boycott this, trust me, there are millions out there that are still gonna pay that. So basically, I'm trying to tell you guys, there is no winning. The moment we win is when we start treating shoes as McChickens. It's worth a dollar and nothing more than that. 